Among the dua we make during qunut in witr is the following dua. Allahumma iyyaka na'bud wa laka nusalli wa nasjud wa ilayka nas'a wa nahfid narju rahmatak wa nakhsha adhabak inna adhabak bil kafirin mulhaq Allahumma inna nasta'inuka wa nastaghfiruk wa nuthni alayka alkhayr ولا نكفرك ونؤمن بك ونخضع لك ونخلع من يكفرك O oh Allah, it is you we worship and unto you we pray and prostrate and towards you we hasten and you we serve. We hope for your mercy and fear your punishment. Verily, your punishment will fall upon the disbelievers. O oh Allah, we seek your aid and ask your pardon. We praise you with all good and do not disbelieve in you. We believe in you and submit unto you and we disown and reject those who disbelieve in you. These beautiful words were not from the Prophet's words, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Then why are we saying it in Qunut? Because these words are from Umar. May Allah be pleased with him. And he's one of the four rightly guided caliphs whom the Prophet, sallallahu told us to follow his sunnah and the sunnah of the four rightly guided caliphs and rulers who come after him. So this is one of his sunnas and saying it in witr is valid. However, it is highly recommended that we use the previous dua, which the Prophet ﷺ taught it personally to his grandson Al-Hasan ibn Ali. May Allah be pleased with him and with his father.